I, you know, I found myself on this road quite by accident. I, I kind of took a, a proverbial turn where you, you see this road and you say, gee, I wonder where that goes. And you suddenly find yourself down it. Um, I was an actor in a workshop. And one day, Michael Masucci, who had taken over Easy TV after the death of John Doerr, came in. And, and he wanted to repay a favor to this man who was running the workshop I was in who had helped Easy TV early on. And I won this contest he had set up as an actress and, and the winning of the contest was to have a video made. And at that time in my life, uh, we were still kind of in a recession. I had graduated college. I think I'd been out of college for about a little over a year. I had asked, for my, I had asked my parents for help and you know to help me in my career as, as a performer and they had refused it and I was an only child and I felt absolutely alone driven but alone and I came out to this meeting and I walked into the space and and I had to be talked into coming to the meeting you know it was kind of like what am I going to do with my life you know um, and my acting partner said, no, no, you've got you've to come, come to this meeting. And so I drove out. I was in Riverside at the time. And I walked into the space, and there's computer art all over the walls. And I had gone to school at UC Riverside, and there the California Museum of Photography was showing computer art. So I was somewhat familiar with it and, and very intrigued by it. And I immediately felt felt that I was at home. And the person who made the biggest impact on my life was sitting in that room, and that was Michael Masucci. And we had a meeting, and we were going to make this video, and I had this very strong feeling, which is very unlike me, to do this. And I turned to him and I said, look, I know this really isn't the time or place, and this isn't the interview for this, but I'm looking for work. And if you know of anything, please, you know, pass my name along. And he said, well, actually, we need help here. And if you think you can handle this madhouse, you're, you're welcome to give it a try. And that was my, my entry. It was completely by accident. What happened from there was that everything just became so compelling and interesting. I wanted to know how everything worked. I wanted to know how to do everything. And I began to take it all on as, as much and as rapidly and as completely as I could. And when I was introduced to editing, when I was introduced to video and the independence of it and, you know, the power of being able to make your own stories and express in your own way and have that recorded and, and, and going in and shaping it, um, it was addictive, it was thrilling, and there was no alternative after that, so I stayed.